Hi guys, Retro Django here. Welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm just so happy and I want to share my happiness with you guys because I just got my cabinets back from powder coating. As you all saw last week, I made a video where I showed my Amiga 3000 cabinets, uh, the metal part that was spray painted black, really, really ugly black. And I decided to uh, to get them cleaned off and painted, powder coated, as bright white as I, uh, as I could get them. And I just got them back. Now this powder coating stuff, it's not cheap. <laughs> it's not cheap, but... Oh my god. I mean, I... I I, I made a little uh, quick peek there at the side and it looks oh my god let, let, let's take a, a closer look at this one guys because let's unwrap it and let's look at it together because I mean the small thing I saw it looked really really nice so let's just uh, see how to oh it's this way let's just open this one together here on part two. Now, if you haven't watched part one, then you know what to do, guys. So let's just be careful now because they just came home, man. They, I mean, on this powder coat thingy, it's oh man. I've really been anxious to get these back. Yo, no, I'm not, not gonna use this one. I'm just gonna be careful and just. Do it the old way. There we go, guys. This looks. Look at this. Oh my god. Oh shit. Oh, it smells great. Whoa. Well, this is my Mega 3000 uh, cabinet. Look at this, guys. Uh, it's just... Oh my God. Right now, I'm thinking about get the, the, the part on the... What's it called? The part on under where the motherboard is, um, is on. I, I want to get that painted also because... It looks incredible. Oh, it looks amazing. Let's just take a quick look at the other one also, guys. Now this one had those four holes drilled on it. They actually asked me if they should do anything and I said just leave the holes alone because they're just gonna be used as <laughs> There we go, the four holes, the, the Amiga 3000 will cool down. Guys, the powder coating is so thick. I mean, can you see it here? I mean, it's just a so, so thick layer. It, it feels like much better quality now. It's, it's hard to explain. It's hard to believe this, but oh my God, let me just take the camera a bit backwards I mean uh, I, I asked about you know scratches and all that and they said that this powder coating stuff it's it's so reliable it's yeah. oh I mean it, it just my expectations were not even close to this kind of it they look incredible guys so the next thing to do is actually find someone to paint the front covers also because uh, I'm gonna show you how they look. I mean, these cabinets, <laughs> they're just so bright white. That's the color I chose for it. It feels like this color is lighter than this, but it, oh, it's just a light, it's just a light effect. Like this, it's the same. And this is 
how it looked before. Again, when I look at the black uh, spray pan, I mean, look at this, guys. Look at this. <laughs> All right, so this one has to be mounted in the front over here. Oh, man. This Amiga 3000 or these, they're just going to be amazing looking. So this one has to be painted also professionally. I'm not going to ruin it by just... I can spray paint them. I have spray painted many times before. I also ride moto motorcycles. <laughs> I ride bikes and I have paint my motorcycles and all that. But I'm not gonna I'm not gonna risk anything with the Amiga 3000 cabinet. Come on, guys, 3000. Well, these are gonna have the same color. I love the color code now, and I I was a little bit you know white and all that. I was a little bit I don't, don't know should i do it should i find the, the the right color as you can see down in, in here but looking at it it looks amazing it's almost let me see it's close to the amiga amiga what's it called amiga 1200 color over there oh man i am just i'm happy guys i'm i'm so happy so uh, let's call this one uh, Amiga 3000 <laughs> video painting video part two. Go back and watch part one if you haven't, because they these cabinets were just they were so ugly. But right now, the paint quality, the cabinet it feels much more thick and oh, higher quality. And this glossy, I, I I said that I wanted this high glossy. It's amazing. I mean, look at this, guys. Look at the quality. I inside, it's not painted. Uh, I can see that. But out here, it's so thick layer. Look at this. Look. I mean. In the beginning of the video, I said that this powder coating was expensive. As of right now, I want to change that. It's not expensive. It's worth every penny. Just go out and do it. If you have a cabinet <laughs> like my Amiga 3000s or Amiga 4000, I also uh, got painted some Amiga 4000. They were so, they had so many scratches and all that. But they look amazing. I'm, I'm thinking about, <laughs> I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. But I'm thinking about, you know, Check the rest, this one, this one, and just get it powder coated. It would be <laughs> all bright white. It would be amazing, but I'm not going to do it because they're just original like that. No spray paint on them. No, no, nothing. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to respect that. So that's not going to be painted, but, but that cover, um, when they also get painted, of course, also the power button here. Then I will come back with a part three, guys. So thank you for your time. Thank you for watching part one and two. And I am personally really, really looking forward to see the end, end result with these cabinets because I was actually, I was thinking about before these ones got colored, I was thinking about sell all my Mega 3000s and I have one that has this, uh, it, it, it's all original, got the original color and, uh, and all that, no, no painting, no nothing. And I, I just wanted to, 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 to keep that one. But when I look at these covers, I feel like I'm going to sell all the others and have this one for myself. I don't care that it's not original color and all that. It looks like new. I just want to lick it. That's how good it looks, guys. It's such an amazing feeling. <laughs> I don't care about those drilled holes. It's all right by me, as I said earlier. Then my Amiga 3000 will cool extra down. That's okay, that's okay, guys. All right, thank you for watching. Have a nice day, guys. Until next time, play some Amiga. Bye.